What's up, everybody? I'm James Duggan, here with Brandon Graber. How you doing? Welcome to the Darkest Dungeon. How dark is it? Uh, not that dark, because our estate is called Hero Town USA, and I made this... estate. Uh, it's brand new, and I made this to show off how to unlock the backer heroes. So, if you were a Kickstarter backer, you were able to create your own hero before the game launched with two uh, locked in positive quirks and one locked in negative quirk, as well as other things like the name, the color, and of course, gets the to abilities. Unlock them now. Yep, you can do this at home. So, let's go ahead and type one in right. Uh, Nicolette. These are, these are non canon names, obviously. You're found! A secret grave, grave robber. robber. Let's see what she's got. She's got a love interest. Uh, she's going to be expensive to rest, but we'll take her. She's got those two locked in positive quirks. So again, you All just right. go to the stagecoach here. You can see the town is totally, totally barren. I haven't even unlocked the tavern yet. And you can do this at any point in the game. You can do it later in the game. Sure. They all come in as level one. All the heroes, like, usually you get them off the carriage, like a group right. of them, every time you come back from a dungeon. Well, let's do another one here. This one I'm very excited to type in. Solid see what Strider. He, solid Strider. Uh, again, these were... Oh, he's a highwayman. He's a highwayman. What does he got? Very fragile. Steady. For a solid strider. Stress damage. That's okay. Fragile. That's pretty cool. And yeah, since they always have uh, very specific uh, perks and sometimes uh, items that come with them, it's, it's interesting because usually this game is very, very, uh, what's the what's the word for it? Uh, roguelike, where right. everything's randomized. So it's kind of a different way to play where you're actually building a team of preset characters. Cardano, um, the Italian mobster. What? Did we not spell that right? C A R D O N O? Uh, D A N O. D A N O, Cardano. There Cardano. He is. Another highwayman. Uh -huh. Why not? Flawed release, natural eye. Why would he give him that? Man, I was just, okay, so if you want an MLG Pro character, you type in <laughs> K. Was it K9? Yeah, it was, was K9. It? No, we've already gotten him, so we can't get him so anymore. You but he's a great Houndmaster. If you dismiss a backer character, you cannot get them back. They're, yep. They are a once in a lifetime opportunity. They're gone. All right, one more. One more. One more. Kane Greaves. Oh, Kane Greaves. Hero found. Man, oh, look at our all highwayman, highwayman uh, bad, bad gambler. That's a pretty good. But one ooh, I like this guy. That, that's pretty good for a highwayman. Uh, I th I would take point blank shot over tracking shot, but that's just me. Um, Got some good camping. This this one's pretty. Oh, yeah. This one's close to MLG. He's not quite MLG. He's uh, definitely in the NA qualifiers though for Dark. So Dungeon. I guess we should point out that uh, if you were not a backer, you probably don't know what any of these names are or where to find them. They're actually in a file on the on, in your Dark Ascension folder. Yep. That's uh, kind of a jumble. So we'll, we're going to show you how yes. to kind of uh, pick out where the names are. We'll do the darkest transition to the dark underbelly <laughs> of the Darkest Dungeon Hero backers. Here we go. Wow, what a dark transition that was. So here we are outside the game in our local files. Uh, you have to go into the Steam folder, wherever you keep it on your PC. And you go into Steam Apps, into Common, and you find your game. There it is, Darkest Dungeon. And then once we're in the Darkest Dungeon, we want to go to Shared and into Hero. And then you'll find Backer underscore Heroes. And this is a .json file, which means it's probably JSON uh, not going to open regularly. So you're going to want to probably open it with um, a there you go. notepad. You remember our jumbled text file? opaque and indecipherable. You'll probably start picking out things like Hendrik the Stalwart and hero <laughs> name and backer name. Um, so the way these are characterized is you can find one whole line. Jacob Finn. Where? John Esch. Camping skills. Daniel John so McKenzie Eric. about here is everything that you need to see. So here we have the person who backed the game, Andrew Courtright, and then where it has, says hero name, uh, Alyssa Garrett. Where do That's we see his social name. security number? <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> so here you find hero name, Alyssa Garrett. That's the name that you want to look for, not the one that's next to backer name, because that's the person who actually backed the game. This is the hero you're creating. So you can find this here, like Morris is the hero name for this one. Uh, the tough part is find out which these which of these names all go into one. So um, I can see stuff like camping skills. So it should be decipherable if you were able to read the matrix. Yeah. And the act, there's actually people found on, on Reddit and other places that uh, right before the backer, and there's a string of random symbols like G square, GF, backer. That's indicative of the class. This is actually the class. Right. Uh, so here's Longshot. This is a grave robber. And you can see here, 
uh, this OBA, this is a, the indicative of the class for the grave robber. So if you just say copy that, put that into here, you can find, find all your grave robbers. And then the one that has the uh, less than sign next to it, that's actually for a hound master. So if you find oh. it all by itself, that's a grave robber. If it has that, that's a hound master. So you keep going hound master. And then here we have another grave robber. Gavin Curie. So you could do all Nick this Tombs stuff. Nick is the hero name. Brandon so, Graber. Yeah. You could also just wait about 24 hours until Reddit deciphers this entire thing the good and get a full of the list. Internet. Yes, we'll do all this work for you. So the important uh, thing here is whether you're pretty deep into the game or whether you're just starting fresh, you have the option to get these hero backers now. My question to you is, do you feel this is a little bit exploity cheaty? Um, I mean, it's your game. You play it how you want to. I, I think it's... It was, you also have three save files, so I could totally do one that's just straight up RNG gods, may they be in my favor, and I'll have one save file that's like, hey, I want to build a really cool team of people who are already preset. Sure. Um, or just, you know, have some, some of each. There's also a sweet money exploit you can pull off with this, but that is another video entirely for all things Darkest Dungeon. Keep it right here on IGN.